Developing tonight, beloved Chicago Bears legend Steve McMichael remains in the hospital dealing with complications from ALS. The outpouring of support for the NFL great and his family is growing. And WGN's Courtney Spinelli is joining us live from Silver Cross Hospital tonight in New Lenox. Courtney. Yeah, good evening to you both, Micah and Ray. Steve McMichael's family says he was rushed here to the hospital last night after he became unconscious. On top of his years-long battle with ALS, he's also now facing a battle of sepsis and pneumonia. I'm so impressed and so humbled and thankful and grateful and just um, amazed. If there's anyone who knows how to put up a fight both on and off the field, it's Steve McMichael. As the Chicago Bears legend remains in the hospital with a team of medical staff and family by his side. Another team rallying to show they're here for him. It means the world to all of us. The support for, from the community is, is amazing. Word quickly spreading about the beloved former star defensive tackle's latest health challenge. Homer Glenn residents, its mayor and first responders showing up in droves to the hospital to support McMichael who's been battling ALS for several years. For Stephanie Midich, this hits especially close to home. She lost her dad to ALS seven years ago to the day. We came today in just awareness of ALS, um, also to the Chicago Bears, and really what it meant for at least the city of Chicago in 1985. <laughs> Misty McMichael says doctors came to check on her husband after he lost consciousness Thursday night. The call to rush him to the hospital eventually made. We had a do not resuscitate on him, but we ripped that up last night because we want him to see himself get enshrined in the Hall of Fame next year. Misty says she was initially told Steve wasn't expected to make it by Friday, saying he was awake and back to his feisty self. We're going to hang on for another year till next August. Because family says being inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame would mean everything. Steve is one of 12 senior candidates for the class of 2024, a milestone his wife says they're hoping he lives to see. Things come at you every day, and you just got to deal with it one day at a time. Now we're told by a contact close to the family that Steve, quote, smiled when he showed him the photos and videos of Mongo's Circus outside. As for the potential Hall of Fame induction, Misty says there is one person especially that they would love to see introduce her husband. And that is our very own Jared Payton reporting live in New Lenox. Courtney Spinelli, WGN News. Thank you, Courtney.